everyone! Welcome to Language Class with Teacher Jane. Today, we will learn about degrees of comparison of adjectives. Our objectives are Identify words that show degrees of comparison of adjectives in sentences. Use words that show degrees of comparison of adjectives in sentences. In this lesson, you will be able to understand the degrees of comparison of adjectives and at the same time, you'll be able to use them correctly. Are you ready? What comes in your mind when you hear the word adjective? You've got it right! Are you excited to try? To begin with your exploration and learning, let's look at the picture and then read the sentences. The strawberry is big. The apple is bigger than the strawberry. The watermelon is the biggest of the fruits. What do you call the highlighted words in the sentences? The highlighted words, big, bigger, biggest, are adjectives. They describe the fruits, the strawberry, apple, and watermelon. Adjectives can be used to compare things. There are three degrees of comparison of adjectives. These are the positive degree, comparative degree, and superlative degree. In positive degree, shows no comparison. Examples The strawberry is big. Just like Kazaya is pretty. Pretty describes Kazaya. Pretty is in positive degree because there is no comparison. Another one. Her dress is long. The adjective long describes the dress. Next. Comparative degree is used to compare two nouns or pronouns. We add er to the adjectives to show comparison. The word than is placed after the adjective. Example, The apple is bigger than the strawberry. The adjective bigger compared the apple and the strawberry. And, we added er to adjective big and the word than is placed after the adjective. Also, in the comparative degree, if the adjective has three or more syllables, we put more before the adjective. Example, the notebook is more expensive than the pencil. The adjective more expensive compared the notebook and the pencil. We put the word more before the adjective since the word expensive has three syllables. Next, superlative degree. It is used to compare more than two nouns or pronouns. We add EST to the adjective to show comparison. The word the is placed before the superlative adjective. Example The watermelon is the biggest of the fruits. The adjective biggest compared the watermelon to other fruits. And we added EST to the adjective. And the word the is placed before the adjective. Also, in the superlative degree, if an adjective has three or more syllables, we put most before the adjective. Example, 
The diamond is the most expensive of them all. The adjective most expensive compared the diamond to the other jewelries. Just look at the picture. We put the word most before the adjective since the word expensive has three syllables. Now let's try to complete the sentences with the correct adjectives. Tagum City is blank than Mati City, but Davao City is the blank city among the three. Big, bigger, biggest. Okay, the correct answer is bigger. Tagum City is bigger than Mati City, but Davao City is the biggest city among the three. Very good. Number two, boys usually have blank hair than girls. Short, shorter, shortest. The answer is shorter. Boys usually have shorter hair than girls. Very good. Next, monkeys are blank but ants are blank. Small, smaller, smallest. The answer is Small monkeys are small, but ants are smaller. Very good. Number four. Lamps are blank, but the sun is the blank. Bright, brighter, brightest. The correct answers are. Yes, lamps are bright, but the sun is the brightest. Very good. Okay, next number. Dora is blank, but Ia is the blank in their class. Beautiful, more beautiful, most beautiful. Okay, very good. Dora is beautiful, but Ia is the most beautiful in their class. Very good. Now, let's learn more about the degrees of comparison of adjectives. When adjectives end in Y, change Y to I and add ER or EST. Tiny, tinier, tiniest. Tiny is in positive degree. Tinier is in comparative degree. And tiniest is in superlative degree. Other example, pretty, prettier, prettiest. When adjectives end in E, drop E and add ER or EST. Example, nice, nicer. Nicest. Nice is in positive degree. Nicer is in comparative degree. And nicest is in superlative degree. Other example. Wise. Wiser. Wisest. When adjectives end in a consonant that follows a vowel, Double the last consonant and add ER or EST. Examples Big, Bigger, Biggest. The adjective big ends with a consonant and follows a vowel E. So we double the last consonant, which is G, and we add ER for the comparative degree. And EST for the superlative degree. Other example, fat, fatter, fattest. We form the comparative and superlative degrees of irregular adjectives by changing the spelling. Let's study this chart. The first column is the positive degree. Comparative in the second column and 
the third column is the superlative degree. Good, better, best, bad or ill, worse, worst, many or much, more, most, far, farther, farthest. More examples. The adjective in the first column is in the positive degree. In the second column, the adjective is in comparative degree. And the last column, they are in the superlative degree. Once again, in the comparative degree, we add ER to the adjective and more before the adjective if the adjective has three or more syllables. And in the superlative degree, we add EST to the adjective and we add most before the adjective if the adjective has three or more syllables. Small, smaller, smallest. Large, larger, largest. Thoughtful, more thoughtful, most thoughtful. Intelligent, more intelligent, most intelligent. Good, better, best. The adjective good, better, and best are irregular adjectives. Study the pictures. Read the sentences and fill in the blanks with the correct forms of adjective. The adjective is tall. Let's compare these three girls. Kazaya, Kyle, and Eliza. Kazaya is blank. The answer is tall. Kazaya is tall. Next. Kyle is blank than Kazaya. The answer is taller. Kyle is taller than Kazaya. Very good. Next. Eliza is the blank of the three girls. Okay, the answer is Eliza is the tallest of the three girls. Very good. Okay, next example. The adjective is big. Look at the pictures. Car. Van. Bus. The car is blank. The answer is big. The car is big. Very good. Next. The van is blank than the car. The answer is bigger. The van is bigger than the car. Very good. Okay, next. The bus is the blank among the three. The answer is biggest. The bus is the biggest among the three. Very good. Okay, next example. The adjective is long. Look at the hair of these three girls. Mary, Maria, and Marian. Mary has blank hair. The answer is long. Mary has long hair. Very good. Next. Maria has blank hair than Mary. The answer is 
Longer, Maria has longer hair than Mary. Very good. Next, Marian has the blank hair in the group. The answer is longest. Mar Marian has the longest hair in the group. Very good. Superb. You have all the excitement to try again the fruit of your journey in this lesson. You have already acquired with all the ideas regarding the topic, right? Now, let's try to answer this. Write more or most to complete each sentence correctly. Number one. My birthday this year turned out to be the blank special birthday ever. The answer is most. Very good. My birthday this year turned out to be the most special birthday ever. Next. Your chocolate cake is the blank delicious dessert of all. The answer is most. Your chocolate cake is the most delicious dessert of all. Next. My mother makes the blank perfect dinner every now and then for the whole family. The answer is most. Very good. My mother makes the most perfect dinner every now and then for the whole family. Now, underline or choose the adjective used in each sentence correctly. Number four, of all the pupils in our class, Chester was the bravest to visit the art museum. The answer is... Yes, bravest. Very good. Number five. The blue whale is the largest mammal of all the sea creatures. The answer is largest. Very good. Thank you for joining me. Let's learn, play, and grow together. I hope you learned something today.